painted a couple times I'm going to write fun sayings on them like love peace keep going this too shall pass and I will leave them outside I'll take one rock with me and I'll leave it outside somewhere for someone else to find so that's kind of fun ladies and gentlemen we're not going to do an art project today we're going to read a book silly Sally by Audrey Wood. This book, our daughter Virginia, who is now a grown up, she brought this book to her first grade class and read it aloud to them. It's super fun. I think you're gonna enjoy it. Here we go. Silly Sally by Audrey Wood. Silly Sally by Audrey Wood for Anne and Warren Wallerstein. I love the illustrations. The author wrote and illustrated this book. Silly Sally went to town, walking backwards, upside down. On the way, she met a pig, a silly pig. They danced a jig. Silly Sally went to town, dancing backwards upside down. On the way, she met a dog, a silly dog. They played leapfrog. Silly Sally went to town, leaping backwards upside down. On the way, she met a loon, a silly loon. They sang a tune. Silly Sally went to town singing backwards upside down. On the way she met a sheep, a silly sheep. They fell asleep. Now how did silly, how did Sally get to town sleeping backwards upside down? Along came Nettie Buttercup walking forwards right side up. He tickled the pig who danced a jig. He tickled the dog who played leapfrog. He tickled the loon who sang a tune. He tickled the sheep who fell asleep. He tickled Sally who woke right up. She tickled Nettie Buttercup. And that's how Sally got to town. Walking backwards, upside down. Ladies and gentlemen, so I can't wait to see you in real life. Have a great evening.